Hi, good day. Today we are going to see about topic 1.2 leaves from unit 1. So basically what are leaves? Leaves is an organ found in a plant which play a vital role in providing and making food. So how they can make food? Okay, they make food with the help of chlorophyll. Chlorophyll is a green pigment found in plants, especially in leaves. Plants use chlorophyll and light to make food. So now we are looking at the structure of leaf. The picture shows a leaf with the veins where ca the veins carries water and nutrition throughout the plants and also leaves. And also the leaves looks green because itself contains the chlorophyll. In other words, as we know chlorophylls are green pigments. And there is a stalk which hold the leaf to the plant. And most leaves will be thin so the sunlight can reach all the cell inside them. So now we are looking at inside of the leaf, in other words, it's a cross section of leaf so that we can see the layers of cell and also the upper layers and bottom layers found in the leaf. So the upper layers and bo the bottom layers are called upper epidermis and lower epidermis. So the upper epidermis is coated by a waxy layer to avoid evaporation. And the first layer in a leaf is palisite layer which contains cells that do most of the photosynthesis. That means this palisade cells contain the most of the chloroplast. And the next layer will be the spongy layer. As a lot of air space, the cells in the spongy layer do a small amount of photosynthesis and their important function are will be saving the gases for photosynthesis. And at the end, at the lower epidermis, you can see stoma. In the plural, it's called stomata. It's a tiny hole which also known as a guard cell which all kind of all sort of gases exchange take place here. And also in between in the middle you can see the vascular bundles. In other words it's nothing. It's our xylem and phylum which carries water and nutrition towards the plants. Thank you.